Many wireless access points have the option to limit bandwidth. This is also known as QoS or quality of service. And what it does is it keeps any particular user from hogging all the bandwidth when they access a wireless access point or a Wi-Fi network. So if I check the box for limit bandwidth use, I can go ahead and scroll down. And here we can see various different speeds for download and upload. Download means bringing files down from the internet, whereas upload means sending files to someone or some device or a website on the internet. And you can see that it's set to one gigabit as the max right now, but you may want to definitely throttle that back down if you'd like to whatever speed that makes sense based on your speed for your access. Now, one way you can tell how much access you have is say by going to google.com and typing in a speed test and it'll tell you what your speed is while you're on the Wi-Fi network. So that way you can properly throttle how much each user is going to get. Now you can also change that instead of doing it by client, you could do it by network and you can say the aggregate of all the different users on the network cannot go beyond whatever amount of speed this is. Now not all wireless access points have this type of feature. This is more of an advanced feature. Most of them will have have the client option, which allows you to throttle that way. Now, there's also a way to do this by guest network. So you can go in when you create a guest network, which means guests can only access the internet and nothing else, and throttle the guest users rather than the internal users, which in many organizations makes more sense. If you change your mind on quality of service, just go ahead and uncheck the box for limiting the bandwidth usage.